Hey, what's up? It's Balaram Shakti. Welcome to another edition of Mosh React, the series where I listen to music for the first time and react to it. If it makes me mosh, cool. If it doesn't make me mosh, also cool. But today's episode is very, very special because I'm doing a Mosh React to a song I've actually heard before and a band I'm very familiar with. As many in the hardcore punk community and the metal world know, we just lost Riley Gale, the singer of Power Trip. He just found out that he died just yesterday. And it really hit me. I was in Austin, Texas, walking around the Lamar Pedestrian Bridge area where we usually have shows during South by Southwest. We used to have guerrilla shows where we'd set up a generator and like everybody would mosh out there in the open on the stage. Last year, No Warning played. Integrity was supposed to play, but they didn't. Iron Age also played. But um, as I was walking with a friend, I get a phone call. And they were like, yo, Riley's gone. And I was like, what do you mean? Where'd he go? <laughs> like, you know? They're like, nah, nah, nah. He's gone. He's dead. And I'm just like, whoa, it just hit me. And I continued my walk. And, you know, I was just hanging out with a friend, just trying to just focus on them and just the experience I was having. And I got back home. It just didn't seem real. I was looking online, seeing all the posts, seeing all the pictures. I'm like, are you serious? This is like unreal to me. And then I went, I tried to go to sleep. I had a hard time going to sleep. And I finally got to sleep and I woke up in the early morning like I do. And I went for a jog and I played Power Trip through my ears and I ran faster. And it felt good to hear his voice. But when I got back home, it really sank in that he's gone. And I just sat down with my back against the wall and I just started to cry. And I cried and I cried. And it was a good cry. I had to let it out. And so this Mosh React is in the memory and legacy of Riley Gale, someone who brought Dallas hardcore together. I lived in Dallas from 2001 to 2012 before I moved to Austin, and I still go to many shows in Dallas, Houston, San Antonio, surrounding areas. And Riley really made Dallas hardcore what it was and what it still is today. Flipped it upside down, booked so many bands, gave people places to stay, like, He's always cool. He was always humble. He was always helpful. He was just the most genuine person you could ever meet. So this Mosh React is to a song. I remember the first time they played this song. You know, I was at Power Trip's first show. And I remember, you know, they were going through and doing more things. And they came out with this track called Divine Apprehension. And we hadn't heard it before. But they're like, yo, you know. We're just gonna we're just gonna test this out. Let's see if you like it. Let us know. And they played this song, and everybody went ape shit. And when the break hit, it was just monstrous. Just <laughs> just people were just destroying each other. Noses were broken. You know, like collarbones were popped out. I mean, it was just it was madness. But it was all in love. So. This Mosh Rat goes out to you, Riley Gale. Divine Apprehension. So good!
that shit. Perfect front man. One time, man, fucking one time for Riley, keep his memory alive, and remember just how cool he fucking was. The dude was just, the dude was cool as fuck, man. You know, like truly one of a kind. Hold on to your friends. Until next time, this has been Mosh React.